to recipes and topics. Today's topic will be what are you guys 2022 goals? That's today's topic. And today we will be making um, a good, um, I don't know, what should I call it? Lotus string beans or something? I don't know. Just know they get all the works up in it and that's going, <laughs> you already know, keep that nigga at home, feed that belly. But anyway, y'all already know what we're going to do. We're going to get into these. <laughs> <laughs> you already know we're gonna get into these baby <laughs> look at them baby look at them baby these 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 uh uh these these uh let me see what i'm gonna call these these roach steppers you know see a roach get it oh shit boom roach steppers ah, but you know <laughs> y'all see them <laughs> y'all already know how it gets down but the first thing we gonna do you already know we're going to get into a shoe swap. So, y'all, anyway, that's today's topics. That's what we're going to be getting into. Uh, how was y'all guys Christmas? How was you guys Christmas? How did it go? Did you guys enjoy it? Did the kids enjoy their gifts and everything? Um, What did you guys get? I ain't get nothing. I ain't even get a candy cane. But, you know, <laughs> it's all good, you know. But I did. I ain't get married. It's just a ring. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just going to wear my little slides today. <laughs> you know how I'm doing it? You know how we doing? Then I'm going to wash these hands and then, you know. Okay, y'all. So the topic is what are your goals for 2022? Um, my goals, my goals, I don't know if it's considered goals, but this is what it is. Um, finding more happiness, peace, prosperity, um, uh, finding what's best for me and my kids, um, learning to stop giving people chances after chances after chances and everything. And, you know, basically believing who they are and stop believing what I want them to be and just let go and move on y'all know i had to <laughs> type this up because who was gonna who was gonna remember this um and you know um finding my purpose in life what i want to do where i want to go you know um trying to make it this year my youtube channel hit really big you know y'all uh, uh, really there really there. you know get your girl up there anywho but yes that's basically what mine is um that's what i want um finding what i want out of life um uh, finding what makes me happy really for real for real um truly genuinely being happy within myself with myself loving myself um um you know leaving all the negativity alone letting people be who they are and whatever and remember and remembering um if they want you in their in their life you'll be in their life stop accepting people in your life if you know you're not really part of their life that's another thing so them basically my goals i really don't have like oh yeah i want to buy a new car and oh yeah 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 okay 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 i do i do want a truck i want a truck i want to um a wagoneer i think that's what it's called um that's what i really want if not i want a tahoe a 2020 tahoe um big grill in the front black on black peanut butter seats you know <laughs> that's what i really want um uh, let's see um i really want to move i want to move to another state um not really but another city i'm not really into like moving and all that i love my place that i'm in now i really do i enjoy it but um, I'm tired of being where I'm at. And I think it's because of all the negative things and all the bad things that happened to me here. I think that's why I really don't want to be here. And I'm tired of people being close. So, you know, they're not even active. My kids don't really have no family here besides uh, my sisters. So, yeah. So, I don't know. I'm definitely going to let you guys know how the journey go and where I end up. Because hopefully you guys will be watching. Hopefully I learn some new recipes. Because ain't nobody dropping no recipes yet. But yes, that is definitely it. But today we're going to get on. Oh, y'all don't forget to let me know 
about y'all goals and everything that's going on don't forget to drop them recipes and topics and you know <laughs> i already know baby please don't waste my time when you do it okay but yes and then we're going to get into what i'm making today i'm making some stream beans load of stream beans i don't know but you know just some cans of stream beans whatever stream beans you want french style regular cup whatever I don't know, but I'm just gonna use that can of potatoes. I already got these open and drained, and I washed them like three times because you know how foods be tasting like canned goods and all that. Mm -mm. I don't like none of that. So I'll be using these. Um, I got some onions, purple onions, regular onions, bell peppers, uh, green, red, and orange. And then I got my, y'all already know, these are my favorite. I gotta order some, I already ordered it, but you know it's gonna be on the way. You know, a cup of water, garlic powder, black pepper, onion, onion salt, didn't even know that was onion salt. That's probably why my food been salty. And I kept saying, ooh, this food's salty. Whole time, this is onion salt, baby. I don't even use that. I don't even know how I did that. Seasoning salt, and y'all already know my chicken bouillon flavor stuff. And then I got my butter. My butter, I don't know why we call it butter, but yeah, the butter, because it's, it's, it's I can't believe it's not butter, but it's butter. But anywho, y'all get my point. So then we're gonna come on over here to this nice old pot. I'm gonna turn it on or whatever you wanna turn it on, cause you know. First, I'm gonna um, tap me some uh, onion powder. First, cause uh, yeah, that's probably why my food is salty. Y'all ain't even gonna cap. I had made some food and I was like, oh my God, this is so salty. It's so salty. I tried to wash it off and everything. I had made some stream beans and they were salty too. I'm like, why is my food so salty? Baby, this must got more salt than onion powder up in there. But anyway, I turned the stove on, turn it on six, whatever you want to turn it on. Cause like I tell you, if you can watch it, you can cook it on high heat. Just don't try it at home. Like, you know, my cameraman say, you know, my cameraman is really not a man, but you get what I'm saying. So I take a, uh, you know, a healthy scoop of, uh, I can't believe it's not butter. My butter already melted because, you know, I was waiting on my cameraman. That's really not a man that was supposed to be in here like so long ago, but it took her still two hours to get here for some odd reason. But yeah. So I definitely throw these, uh, little bell peppers, whatever up in here. You know, if you want to stick your hands up in there, you can go ahead and do that. But you know, I don't need my fingers smelling like um all that extra stuff. You know, we ain't got time for that. You let that cook up a little bit, and this is why I like to uh, turn my stuff up because you know I'm, I'm impatient. I really am. Let me stop the banging. Let me. Let me princess mix it. <laughs> uh, but yeah, you let that cook up or whatever the case may be. Now, me personally, I like to add my seasoning because for some odd reason it dries out this, um, I can't believe it's not butter. Put some onion powder up in here. Got that. Got that black pepper up in there. No, just a little bit. Little seed and salt, you know what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. Sprinkle that up on there. I ain't really got no garlic powder. I mean, I got garlic powder, but not the kind I like. That's the only kind I like. My daughter been eating it all. But you know, if I need some more, I got some more. And then y'all already know. Gotta, gotta, gotta throw this up in there. I'm trying to tell y'all. Trying to tell y'all. I just trying to tell y'all. Y'all ain't got this. Y'all don't know what y'all doing. I don't care what nobody say. You gotta have this in your house. Order cubes, whichever, you know, whichever one you prefer. I like the powder because I do. I'm gonna add some more of that so I don't need to add too much because. When it's all cooked down, get the, you know, let it cook down. It's gonna look all good, you know. So when it's all cooked down, I'm gonna come show y'all what it look like. So yeah, 
We'll be back. Y'all already know I have to come back. Because, uh, baby, I forgot these bacon bits. You got to add this up in there while you um, doing this. For the, all the flavor and stuff to seep out. You got to do it. You got to do it. If you don't do it, you ain't do it right, baby. This you got to do. So now. Now we're going to be back when it's good down. Okay, so we back. <laughs> yeah, I know it's quick as... Because you already know I got this heat turned up. Like I said, as long as you watch it, you can cook it. See how I look all gravy-like and stuff? <laughs> oh, fat. Then you get to put them cans up in there. You <laughs> know what I'm saying? And you don't really need a lot of water, to be honest. For real, for real. I ain't even gonna lie. Because I don't even really be putting all that up in there. Because I be wanting to dry out. Now, normally when I cook my string beans and stuff like this, I put it in the oven. You could top it with cheese and all that. You know, call it loaded string beans. You know what I'm saying? And you just cook it, cook it, mix it around, cook it how you want to cook it. I like my stuff overcooked because um, I just do. It's going to taste better that way. To me, it do. So, but y'all see how that look? All good. All them flavors hitting like that. All that. But definitely put this stuff, if you got time, definitely put this in the oven. And let it cook for a, a whole nother hour. Huh? I'm trying to tell you. Gonna be the best string beans you ever had in your life. And don't care. See people be talking about I pick my string beans fresh. Look. Ain't nobody got time for that. Stop playing. If you don't cook that food and call it a day baby. And, 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 and keep it moving. So I'm making these string beans and stuff. Girl y'all let me tell y'all what's going on right now. So my heat just went off and, and my door opened. And, 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 and my cameraman, that's really not a man, she, she, apparently she done got scared and startled. Her hand is on her chest. She think it's a ghost up in here. Now this happened last time. Why are you doing all that? But anyway, you cook this up. Oh yeah, I'm cooking um, pork steak. Um, I, I don't think I'm going to do a gravy. I don't know. Should I do it? I don't know if I'm going to do a smothered pork steak. Or what with some um, rice or mashed potatoes. I probably do rice because my kids really don't mess with mashed potatoes like that. And I probably do some rolls and that's going to be our dinner. Because I'm definitely going to say these stream beans for later for dinner. Or whatever the case may be since we up, you know, for the first time making this stuff. Or making this video early. Round it, it's 208. So yeah, you cook this. It don't matter what it look like. It don't got to be all looking all delicate and fine and stuff. Once it gets to dry out, I promise you, I don't even know why I put this water up in here because you really don't need it. Just a little bit. No, you know what I be using this water for? I use this water. I use this water just in case it's salty. Baby, taste that seasoning. If it's salty, add you some water. You can always fix something. People be like, just add a little sugar to take away the salt, the saltiness. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't be doing that. I don't care. See, you see how it's making its own juice. And then that's when you, you know, once all that stuff gets to drying out, you got to cook it on high heat, you know. Got to cook it on high heat for it to be like that. Stop mixing it because you don't want it to be, uh, Mushy. yeah, baby food. Mm. Okay. And then, you know, I taste my little salt. Mm. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. You know, it could lose, it could use a little, uh, more seasoning salt. No, just a little bit. A little onion powder. Make sure you get the onion powder for real, not the onion salt. Be up in here like, mmm. Like you eating sour candy. And I always put a little more of that, you know, that bouillon. Gotta put it up. It's, look, am I saying that right? Am I saying that right, teacher? Mm -hmm. Okay. You know, just a little bit. You know, at this point, you know, you just gotta fold it in. Fold it in. Ain't that starting to look so good? And I promise you, if you just put it in the oven for like a good 45 minutes, I ain't even gonna lie, like a good 45 minutes. See, I let my, you know, stuff cook all day because, you know, it, it's still gonna taste good. See, you see how when it get the, ooh, like that, it's gonna turn off thick and coat everything. Get that water up out of there, baby. Fold it in, <laughs> you know, fold it in, <laughs> you know, fold it up, fold it up like how you be doing your nigga when you know, when he find out he be cheating on you, fold him up. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I really hope y'all mans don't be cheating on y'all for real. I just be talking, but you know, it be happening. 
it be happening. But them goals, y'all definitely got to let me know about them goals that y'all trying to hit this year. I, I'm very interested in it. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So you let that cook. Let all the liquid dry out. Because, you know, this on the stove. Now, if it's in the oven, pour that water up in there. Put you some more bouillon up in there. And let that stuff cook, 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 baby. And that's how you do it. And that's basically it right there. You know, that's basically it. You let it cook up. I'm going to bowl this where she can taste it because I know it's going to be good. But like I said, if y'all want it to be smackalicious, put it in the oven. You can put it in the oven like this and sprinkle some cheese on the top. No lie. But yeah, so I'm going to plate this up. She going to taste it. And then, baby, we going to be back. Okay, y'all, we back with these string beans. Y'all know it ain't plated up because it's early, but you know, you know, you know, you know. Making pork steak and all that. Now she finna do this little test. I'm trying to tell y'all, y'all try these string beans, make you want to smack your baby daddy. Huh. Stop playing. Uh -huh, get all that. I'm trying. I should have got you a spoon, mm -hmm. huh? Oh, okay. Let me get a spoon. I already got it. <laughs> oh, okay. Her eyes rolling. Dang, I wish y'all could see her. Is it good? My eyes is not rolling. Your eyes is definitely just rolling. I had to close my eyes to taste. Mm -hmm. oh. oh, okay. Is it good? Yeah, it's good. Is it really good? Got enough season, maybe a little more salt? Probably needs to use that onion salt. <laughs> <laughs> it's good? Yeah. Uh, okay, y'all. Y'all let me know. And y'all need to... Y'all need to let me know if... Uh, if y'all be trying these recipes and if they be good... Let me know. Cameraman, that's really not a man. How you tried any of these recipes? Yep. Was they good? Yep. Oh, okay. So y'all definitely need to try these recipes. Don't forget to drop some recipes. Drop them comments. Let me know what you think. Tell me about your um goals this year and everything. And baby, and baby, y'all already know. Drop them comments. But baby, please don't waste my time.